Good morning, guys, or good evening if you happen to be on the other side of the world, or good afternoon, whatever time it is where you are. Um, so I'm still busy listening to every 2015 release, um, because I have so many, but so many, or so little time to do it. Um, so this is a CD collection update um, with some late Christmas gifts that I was given. I was given some more Best Buy gift cards. So I just bought some more stuff from there, and um, one of them because I couldn't make a final decision on the last one, uh, shipped it, shipped out the other day, and the last one that I ordered a month ago on Christmas, the day after Christmas, is finally on its way here because Best Buy majorly screwed up. Um, well, I can't completely blame Best Buy. Best Buy and the post office screwed up. Let's put it that way. So, anyway, here are these four that I ordered uh, last week. They came in on Friday. Uh, the first one, I'll save that one for last, actually. The first one is Rich Here by Enslaved. This is actually the deluxe edition, the digipack, uh, the booklets in this panel, and then there's the CD, DVD. Um, very, like, it's just an amazing album. Uh, black metal, folk metal from Norway. I really do like this record. This is actually the record that got me into Enslaved. Um, so I'm going to go back and listen to some of their past material from this. And by the way, if my voice sounds hoarse or, and I sound or look like crap, I've been sick since Saturday. Um, since I came back from Bowling Green, Kentucky. I, I just I haven't been feeling great, so... That's why I'm making this video now, is because I'm not at school. Um, the next two sort of go together. They're by the same artist. Came out, both came out last year. No, one came out after the other, though. Um, we have Vertical and Vertical 2 by Cult of Luna. Uh, they're both in some form of a digipack. Uh, vertical. Um, I've never seen with this square in the center of the artwork before. Uh, I'm guessing that's just because it's the deluxe edition, I guess. It has a bonus track called The Flow Reversed. Um, but here's the inside. The booklet's over here, and the disc is over here. So there's Vertical. And then Vertical 2 is just a four-track EP. Um, there's the back. The CD is actually in the back panel. And there's no booklet with it. It's just this inside uh, flap with the lyrics and credits and stuff. Um, and it does have a remix of Vicarious Redemption from the from Vertical 1 uh, by Justin Broderick from Jesu and other stuff. I don't remember everything he's from. And then the last one, which I've been wanting for a while, Best Buy finally took it off back order, so I took the opportunity and I ordered it. Woods 5, Gray Skies and Electric Light by Woods of You Pray. This is a 2012 release. This was my album of the year for 2012. And I have no regrets with that. Uh, Woods of You Pray, Woods 5 is just a phenomenal album. And there's just nothing else that can be said about it. If you if you have this album and you've never really taken the time to like focus on the entire album, music, lyrics, vocals, everything, then you need to pull out the CD booklet and maybe you need to pull out the CD booklet and just listen to the entire album and read along with the lyrics in this booklet. Very emotionally pulling record. Um, and I believe, judging by Best Buy's website, they are re-releasing Woods 3, The Deepest Roots and Darkest Blues, um, because they do have it available for pre-order on vinyl and on CD. So, looking forward to that. Alright guys, so that's it. Um, I'll probably have another collection update video for you Thursday. Maybe an honorable mentions list out today. I'm not quite sure yet. I'm still listening to albums from 
this year. In fact, what I'm going to go ahead and give you as soon as my music program loads, I'll give you everything I have I have listened to, and then everything I still need to listen to from last year. So, albums I have already listened to are if you Betty, I'll just give you what I need to listen to. I still need to listen to Sky Swallower by Vatnet Viscar, Hail to the King by Avenged Sevenfold, um, Deceiver of the Gods by Amona Mark, uh, Ungrateful by Escape the Fate, um, what else? Paramore Self Titled, Vengeance Falls by Trivium, End of the Dream State by Encircle, From Death to Destiny by Asking Alexandria, Between Here and Lost, actually, no, I take that back, I listened to that one. Dust Walker by Fenn, Echoes of Battle by Caladan Brood, Old Morning's Dawn by Summoning, Symphonies of the Night by Leaves Eyes, uh, Sunbather by Death Heaven, um, The Living Infinite by Soil Work, both discs, um, The Stone and Echo live album by A Perfect Circle, Teeth, Glory, and Injury by Altar of Plagues, the Last Spire by Cathedral, Mare by Kevlar Attack uh, or Kevlar Attack. Outlaw Gentlemen and Shady Ladies by Volbeat. Uh, Burials by AFI. Um, the House of Golden Bones Part 2 by Stub Sour. And that's actually it. Um, if there's anything. 2013 you want me to listen to and see if it makes my list leave it down in the comments other than that I'll see you guys later hopefully with my letdown honorable mention and finally to put 2013 to rest the top 25 or 30 albums or however many happen to be on there of 2013